finally doing it. <laughs> I can't believe it's here. You can't believe Neither it's can here. I. Yeah. Especially after the last couple days. Yeah. But you're going someplace, Bree. That's right. <laughs> you make things happen. Going someplace. Yeah. My dad always drives me to the airport. We're finally on route to the first flight at my 2 p.m. to Newark. I'm gonna miss you, Daddy. -o. I miss you, Breezy. <laughs> I love you. So I if you watch you. this when you're in Africa. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> you're here. And I'm talking to you there. I love you. I know. Okay. I'm talking to you in both. <laughs> okay, this is for you in Africa. This is. Yeah. This gets you there. Yeah, this <laughs> gets me there. I'll See. keep watching it. to go down a path that was calling me. <laughs> Little did I know, you follow your dreams and the rest will come into place for you. This is what my home of 35 years all of a sudden looked like. Boarded up a dark looming cloud over a place that gave me so much light for so many years. It's the people you meet, the family you have, and the friends you build a community with that are important in the end. The experiences and the memories that stick. <laughs> I sure have those. Between the political war we were in, the hate crimes, discrimination, and injustice, the energy of the world, I hit my limit. I felt stuck in a place that I loved so dearly, and I had to go. I am so excited. <laughs> Overwhelmed, I feel nervous, I feel, since I booked this flight today, it's becoming more and more and more and more real every second. I feel like I gotta start packing up my house, but I just loudly keep getting reminded, just go. You will, oh. My dog almost just chased a reflection off a mountain. Well, Mike, a lot to do. Gotta get work permits. Gotta get it fully funded. But you know, this show on the road. I mean, sometimes you just gotta jump. Thirteen day countdown. Truth is, if we could change one heart um, or a few, a change of heart can can touch. The lives of millions. I mean, yeah, it's really cool because I have no idea what I'm getting myself into right now. <laughs> we have completely lost funding, and the woman that I was working with completely disappeared. You learn, you learn, you live and you learn. Um, 
together so much more than just the project so we all get caught up you know and like we have to find funding we have to do this we have to do this to be able to do this are we off the cute he's the love of my life Get together he and i can conquer anything he's a light chaser <laughs> it's not a bad quality to have <laughs> my vet permit in south africa has finally been found i am in america i'm in los angeles california so i will not be picking it up at the location that they just sent me they've lost it three times <laughs> these yawns though and now i'm dealing with the airline the blood work starts at the right temperature in Germany and Japan, but we got to prove return to me within the 30 days of the testing of the 30 days. And then five days before the travel, I need a hard copy sent in time before my flight of the finalized health certificate that approves everything that we've been doing for the last three months. Imagine the nerves of the timelines here. I am just trusting. I know you have all of this under control, but I gotta tell you, can't go without them. That's just what it is. New dilemma. Same outfit, different day, different tunes. Um, my vet just called me and our new biggest struggle is, <laughs> I was gonna scream. I was gonna scream sing, scream sing. Six days. I can't believe it's happening. No, no, out. I made it out of the house. That was quite the job. I should have hired four movers instead of two and using myself all day. Collected a lot of trash over the last 14 years of my life. The smallest things will make you break down and cry in life, like opening a window. The dust will affect you for the rest of your life. Oh, make sure that you own a truck because it's just the way to go. And it's also really fun to drive up and down a hill like a little speed racer. Thank you, Kim Rocco Shields, for this bad boy. Lesson number five is rash. Check it out. Wow, I look beat up. Yeah, look like I've been through the works today. Shenanigans have just begun. I also feel like there's a nail in my tire. You hear that noise? Whoa, I can't believe this is the last time I'm driving through this canyon. Well, like, not like forever, but who knows, right? Who knows where the life is going to take me next? I'm gonna go off-roading like nobody's business. Like nobody's business. All right, I'm tired. It just makes me really sad. Here's Maverick and Birdie, your great-grandchildren. Those are your great-grandchildren. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Isn't that something? It is. Yeah. Very few people see their own grandchildren. It's so true. Look at that face. I don't know if that's Isn't that something? Yeah. yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. Oh, well. This is for you, Jasper. So we're going to be kissing you. <laughs> <laughs> Today is such a good day!
supposed to be leaving today but ran into just a total shitstorm last night for way too many way too many things happened all within a 10 minute span Heathrow needed its own health certificate for max just to walk through the airport to switch flights which we did not have trip for tomorrow we got it all got a six hour leg and a 15 hour leg I just went back to my old house some extra mem 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 memorabilia loaded it up sideways on my hill into my car Very heavy stuff I'm soaking wet sweating and uh it's been hard, man. COVID is at a stage four lockdown. I'm walking into a cesspool <laughs> and all I want to do is be there. I'm really grateful to be alive. And my friends and my family have made everything worth it. <laughs> hey buddy, are you ready to go to Africa with me? Are you ready to go to Africa with me? How many days before we leave for Africa? 24 hours. We are repacking. Max has been doing this weird thing tonight where he's kind of trying to hump me. He never does that. He's so aggressive. Another curveball. It is July 1st. Woke up at 5 for my 10 a.m. flight this morning that's been changed for the fourth time. Like the anxiety and stress is just. It's so hard to breathe. Like when things like this happen, you're trying to figure out if you're like fighting it or you're not supposed to be going. Or his back's not supposed to be going. I just keep remembering that I can't go without him, so it's like not an option. You know, and yeah, I think my boyfriend and I are breaking up right now. I can't wait for all this to be over. I can't wait to be sitting the new house it's settled and safe and not so tired totally feel alone right now really sucks it's a terrible feeling I must say but uh, this is all happening for a reason I know it I can't wait to find out what it is I can't wait to sleep and be like quiet so I can hear I like, feel like I can't even hear right now, you know? I'm gonna try to get Max to take a shit because we have a lot of traveling coming up. <laughs> Walking around in my old neighborhood that I grew up in. The last walk through the neighborhood for a while. Oh, I can't wait to see these animals again. It'll be so healing. <laughs> I'm not crying, you'll cry. <laughs> <laughs> it's been so easy getting into your hands, but they just let us walk right through the style. Well, never met a little 
morning video. <laughs> morning, yeah. Max. It's 6.40. Went to bed a little later than expected because I went through a breakup. My ex-boyfriend's dad called me. <laughs> Molly and I had a spirit leave the room. <laughs> and... They're take all of our shit with them, so it took fine. all of our shit with them, so we're just dealing with it. It took, it also took the um, the uh, hydration <laughs> out of our bodies. Yeah, it's cold moisture. <laughs> <laughs> it took the hydration, <laughs> but um, Mommy. we're leaving it all in Joburg. We're going to spread. <laughs> Lock me up, don't wanna leave 